everyone, this is Bowser Galaxy 10. Welcome back to Cross Code. We're gonna do this quest. The what broken is broken. Found that now all things things must, must come together, together to reveal the, the truth. truth. So yeah, we need to go talk to... It feels the like they had two actors for that, but they couldn't decide which one should do it, so they just had to both do it. <laughs> Shut up, Tony. <laughs> Me or Apollo would have like a 50 minute speech on why why that choice was made. <laughs> Hi! Leah dear, how can I help you? Oh, do you want me to look at those items? Oh, would you look at that? You found yourself the broken equipment of the ancients! Did you collect them all ancients? by yourself? <laughs> Congratulations, dear. So now you want to open the old observatory, eh? <laughs> well, you came to the right place to get some help. Let's see, we need a player from each class. A happily fill in as the Quadra Guard. Here's a Spearmancer, this leaves Tribe Leader, Pentafist, and Hexacast to be filled. Oh, I know! Why not ask Emily and Trani? I'm sure both would be. I'm pretty be sure they're outfits. busy. <laughs> <laughs> so the only thing missing is a Tribe Leader. I believe Buggy hasn't entered the observatory yet, so he'll be a perfect fit. Is that okay with you? Alrighty, I'll well, contact Buggy and tell him to meet at the observatory. I'm sure you want to ask Emily and Tommy yourself. <laughs> when you're ready, meet me in front of the observatory, okay? Oh, this gets me all excited. It's been quite a while since Al and I did this event. I'll be going on ahead. See you later, Leah. Bye! Now I got the observatory. Wait, don't we have to ask Strani and Emily? <laughs> Why? Because <laughs> apparently they're mute and they're, they're completely deaf. <laughs> hey, Leah. Hello, dear. Hi. Looks like everyone is here, eh? Hello, you two. Bonjour, how are you guys doing here? <laughs> are you deaf? How are you guys doing here? <laughs> what? Didn't Leah tell you? Ow! Buggy, the joke's getting a bit old. Ah, uh, sorry man. I'm surprised Jolt doesn't send me that whenever I do the jokes. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot, I've only done this quest like once, okay? I never, didn't think of God. it when I read that text box. <laughs> anyway, we are here today because Leah has found the five broken relics. With these, she can unravel the secret behind this ruined observatory. However, all five virtues must come together in unison. So which one of us is heart? <laughs> I feel like Emily. They just Earth, wind, Emily. fire, water, and heart. <laughs> which one's heart? <laughs> It'd either be Buggy or Emily. <laughs> Well, I mean, each of the classes is associated with one of the gods, which is also associated with one of the elements. So which one's heart? <laughs> I think that'd be Leah because she's associated with the main with. So, the main so one. everyone's heart is in their balls. As long as there's loot, I mean. I didn't know there was such an event. Well, it's not easy to find, as it's not connected to any other quest. Each region has a secret area that contains one of the pieces. Oh. oh well, I was never good at finding all those secret locations. Typical new players, they don't know the joy of walking aimlessly through the wilds for hours. He plays all Skyrim. Find a piece of broken equipment. <laughs> Where are you, yo, buggy? It's a secret to everybody. Where's my wooden sword? You haven't found any of these items either. Your items are set for the week. Precisely. So what exactly do we need to do? Wait, wait, where is the loot? It's quite simple, actually. First, each one of us needs to hold one of the relics. The sword for the triad blader, the shield for the quadra guard, the gauntlet for a pentafist, the deck for a hexacast, and finally, the chakrams for a spheromancer. I would have loved if it was a hat. <laughs> then we stand next to the plates here and fill the relic, fit the relics in. Yes, I'll, I'll fight with my hat. My hat is my power. Kingdom Hearts' is hat. 
<laughs> and the rest is in the hands of the ancients. Sounds simple enough. Let's get on it. Right, the idea. Do you mind handing each each of us one of the relics? No. <laughs> game over. <laughs> a side quest. Why would that be a game over? Now, everyone, fit in your relics and then step on the plates. Wow, funky! Game over. What's <laughs> <laughs> a side? Suck it, Blue! What just happened? Looks like we got transported into the observatory. Why not just open the door? I'm actually wondering about that tool. Maybe it's only to make sure only five enter at the same time? Well, best to just have a look around, right? Yes, I want my loot! <laughs> hey, we don't get damage from that. Ooh! <laughs> you have conquered even the most daring trials. You, the traveler, the envoy of change. To seek wisdom of the gods, we built this observatory. May it be your guiding light and wait for the message from the sky. For your achievements, we grant you the ability to become even stronger. CP for all elements obtained! Let your every step form the path of your growth. It's one CP. <laughs> I think it's one CP for each element, including neutral. Well, that's boring! I mean, that's basically a free level. This was not worth it. <laughs> it basically gives you a free level. This is, not, it's, it's, this is, this is pretty good. That's not worth it at all. Okay, whatever. It's stupid. Uh, karma steel, even though I probably won't use it. Uh, Why do you do this? <laughs> I'm gonna show it off. Ancient Sun! I thought we were supposed to snuff out the light. Finally, Gatling Artillery! <laughs> artillery. Because <laughs> Arctic. Oops. Get me out! Get me out of here! Hey, look, there's a random comment on the wall. Why is there the Madonna? <laughs> oh, there you are, dear. Hi! And, did you like what you saw? To think, this is where the ancients gazed upon the stars. I especially love the bunnies on that mural. Oh, come now, buggy. Those were clearly meant to depict the ancients themselves. Is it not bird people, but bunny people? Anyway, where are the other two? <laughs> Welcome back. How was it? Well, it certainly was interesting. We got some nice CP to spend. Yes, more power for me. All thanks to our Sherry Leah. Leah? Huh? Me? Uh, no need to thank me. I'm happy I was able to help. Especially with an event so rich in lore. I hate to break up the party so soon, but I gotta run. That's alright. Sadly, this is where the event ends anyway. I guess I'll make my way back to headquarters, eh? See you soon, everyone! Bye! Au revoir! Bye! Who's there for bashing some monsters with our newfound powers? Oh wait, I haven't used my up my CP yet. Come on, Trotty. Beat him up! <laughs> Revenge! Kill them all! Oh yeah, that's enough. No, wait, 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 wait. There's, there's one more. Thing we have to do. There's one more thing we have to do, and then we can move on to do the arena. Beat up a head. We're getting there. I just have to get ready for it while I'm on the way there. Get 
Ready into fighting, aren't you? This is one of my favorite comments. Revenge! This is one of my favorite comments. Um, anyone up for a break? I love that Never. comment. It's one of my favorites in the whole game. Anyone up for a break? Never. <laughs> anyway. Oh, we were just about to get the S rank. <laughs> we haven't heard that since, like, part... Early. <laughs> like, four-ish. <laughs> No, that's not what we're doing. We're right here! To the arena! I think the last time that we that we heard that music was back when we actually named the the quest titles. <laughs> like how we saved Christmas that one time. Cops! This is... Yes? I'm confused. These faction... The faction advanced cup and the faction team cup was uh, not on my version of the game. Huh. Huh. <laughs> I probably didn't update it or something. <laughs> Oops. Or didn't do the quests. Those looked like they were quest things. Oh, you probably yeah, you probably have to do all the, do all, all the quests for them to show up. That would make sense. All right. <laughs> so I guess you got some more blind content. Yay! <laughs> Assist him up. Here we go. <laughs> well. So yeah, we're gonna do some arena things. I'm not doing rush mode. It's hard. <laughs> Aww. And it's basically just doing all of them in a row with the only healing 50% between each round. Yeah, what's the problem? Do it! Pain. But pain is good! Pain is... Pain is weakness leaving your body! After, well, I should probably make sure I have my circuit <laughs> set up right first. Right where, Joel? Uh, It sounds like I should hear this at, at a freaking disco area in Pokemon XD. <laughs> sounds like I should be hearing this at, at Club Krabby or whatever. Krabby Club. That's the name. That's I remember. Uh, calamity trigger. Uh, yeah. That does a twist, has the waltz. Uh, yeah, let's do that. Okay. Rookie Cup, afternoon attackers. Go, go, Leah! Aww. Yeah, these are the solo ones. Aww. <laughs> Why are they so high level? Because How it's a level bird... Because it's like a level 55. How does a bird with match? headphones get that? Not any experience points. <laughs> All it's it does a, is it's, it's, it's the equivalent of a diglet. I think it's more like a groundhog. But yeah. It looks like a bird. <laughs> oh, I, oh, I got hit. That's fine. Great work. <laughs> yeah, just so you know, I'm probably gonna get terrible scores on these. I'm not that great at these. My goal is to pass them, not to get a not to get a good score. We are not we are not platinuming these. <laughs> Otherwise, we'd be here all. Do you get any special reward for platinuming them? Uh, you just get you get more points, which you can spend at the shop. 
Oh, so what you're saying is that is that this is the battle frontier, which we will never show an emerald. <laughs> in Pokemon Emerald. Good to know. <laughs> At least I didn't waste my. At least I didn't waste my uh, thing. <laughs> Rush mode's hard, so I'm not gonna use it. Hasn't been. <laughs> oh, this one, even this one's hit. Okay, but do you really want me to want to watch me do the same matches twice in a row? Because I, I would literally just. What do the heck am I looking at right now? <laughs> uh, these are slightly different enemies. They are. Yeah. Just deleting this one guy. <laughs> I mean, we're just using it. <laughs> it's like it's supposed to be an AOE comment art, but I just use it to kill. So if anyone, if anyone's wondering on on why yeah, where like, the commentary like is, I don't know what you're asking about. I guess we can look at this arena commentary as a preview for what V2R will look like when I do those arenas. <laughs> <laughs> and I got bronze. That's what you should probably expect for a lot of these. <laughs> so yeah, basically, to get a good score, you have to do them, like, fast and without taking damage, mostly. Uh, hmm. And get a high chain. Hmm. Which mostly just means do a glass cannon build and don't get hit. <laughs> and be very aggressive. That's how you platinum. <laughs> It's actually Drink, very satisfying so to watch. So eat the item that the makes items. you invincible. Understood. Uh, do not believe that exists because this is a hard video game. <laughs> I say that, but you can probably point to hard video game that you can do that in. Why <laughs> are we fighting the f that one boss from Mother Free? <laughs> uh, because they liked Mother Free and they decided to make an enemy that's like that boss. Probably. Oh, I forgot to use fire. <laughs> We're never gonna get Mother Free in America, are we? At this point, I've just completely given up, mostly because I'm older and realize what what kind of issues, what kind of controversies would pop out from it. You know, because I can definitely see all the, all, all the, all the, all the, all the mur, all the, the family murder, the, the suit, the Klaus's suicide, by the way, spoilers from Mother Free. <laughs> <laughs> well, frick. Getting high on mushrooms, and pretty much everything to do with the Mad Gypsies. <laughs> I can see that going well. Of course, Nintendo could just make the game M-rated, and it'd probably work fine, but, you know. <laughs> Nintendo doesn't make M-rated games. <coughs> Except for, like, two. Nintendo rarely makes M-rated games. Heh, <laughs> Nintendo rarely. Because Rare made an M-rated. <laughs> Makes me question what an M-rated Zelda game would look like. Uh, Darksiders. <laughs> I thought you were about to say Dark Souls. <laughs> I mean, the combat in Dark Souls is kind of rep reminiscent of Zelda, for being honest. I don't remember Crab Turtles. Ah, <laughs> uh, we didn't fight very many of them. Oh, okay. I remember the Tim mostly because I th because of what I think the reference is. That's about it. And even then, I don't know if the reference is right. I keep forgetting that I don't actually have this co that comment art in this one, because I think it sucks. But I usually I end up getting it anyway. Ow. Dead. Bryce. 
So let's take a guess on what video games will be out by the time this Let's Play comes out. Uh, let's see here, probably that one Mario Party game, which is what the top 100 should have been. That's on the Switch. We might actually get a title on Breath of the Wild 2. And Freedom I'm Planet to do that. And Freedom Planet 2 will still not be released. <laughs> oh yeah, by the way, you also get penalized for using you get a score penalty for using items in the arena. Honestly, I don't like one thing that's annoying about the arena is uh your items all wear off as soon as you start a round, so if you if you wanted if you just want trying to beat these rounds and you're trying to use items uh, and you screw up, you, you're gonna lose the items. So if you really want to save up, save your items while doing this, you, I, so what you're I'm saying is that do the exact same thing I do in Kingdom Hearts One, <laughs> where I save beforehand. <laughs> Yeah, and if I, and, and if I die have... and if I die just <laughs> reset that file and get my items yeah. back. What's kind of annoying cross code is you have to go ah! there's, there's no load game option from the menu. You have to go all the way back to you have to go back to the title sc screen to load the new save file. That's no, that's that. never something that I get that pee of the bad. Yeah, it's not that bad, but it's kind of annoying. Especially in this game where where the loading screens are actually really damn good. Yeah, load times. Where it's like if it was a really bad load time, then I'd be angry. It's a minor annoyance. Speaking of which, I've actually been playing a lot of the PS4 games now on my PS5 since I got one, and, and good god, even the PS4 games have really good loading times. It makes Crash 4 actually doable! <laughs> it makes Crash 4 actually... Oh wow, I got a gold! <laughs> it actually did good! I did good! I did good, everybody! <laughs> And in the Crash and Saint trilogy, Aku Aku isn't isn't judging me anymore on the loading screens because he can barely pop into the screen before the level's loaded. I feel so good not being judged. <sighs> I feel bad for my Switch because once I got the PS5, I've just been playing that mostly. <laughs> Even though I have a bunch of games on my Switch that I have to be playing. Then again, Joel probably knows that feeling of, of having a bunch of games but never playing them. I try to avoid it as much as I can. How's that Persona 2 that I let you, let you borrow? It, 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 it is limited. I have, I have limited success because it's usually I avoid buying... And I've died. So that's what happens. That's what I make you get if you lose a round. It's kind of nice. I like it. I don't it's want sad. sadly. It's sad. Sadly, it sad. makes me sad. Happy Leah makes me sexy. What? <laughs> what? Why? Why? Because. Because we're Sonic heroes. Well, I just took a minigun to the face. <laughs> okay, that, that one cat was just like, I'm just gonna run around in circles, I'm tired. <laughs> he like didn't even attack, he just kinda like, I'll run around in circles, oh man, I'm so exhausted. <laughs> so how did the sloths and cat get the spin dash? remember Blaze being able to spin dash. She might be able to in Sonic Rush, actually. I don't remember. I don't remember Sloths being able to, though. 
Why are we can't coming humming hiding the his crotch? <laughs> That's uh, not the right move. Ah, stun lock. I just accident. realized that I said that Dragon Ball Z joke as you're doing a key thrust attack. <laughs> huh. Wait a minute. This is intentional. Ridge Rivals! Remember that one? Now I want a racing game, game with these two in it. Where's our racing mini game in CrossCode? Well, they didn't feel like they, they probably didn't feel like they had good mechanics for it. <laughs> that so doesn't stop. That doesn't stop. Their mini people. games use the core mechanic. In CrossCode, they they pretty much make mini games that at least use the core mechanics. Even if they add, they, they're usually putting a gimmick on top of the core mechanics of the game. Which IMO is part of what makes the game, part of what makes this game so good. And <laughs> what makes that one optional fight with don't use this freaking hilarious. <laughs> Run away! They should have had the kart racer in the unused section. <laughs> Just have a random kart racer in the unused area. <laughs> That we went to previously. I believe that was twenty-third quest episode. You know, never mind. The V2R arena is way faster than this. <laughs> well, part of that is because I'm bad. <laughs> Why are you bad at CrossCode? <laughs> I thought you liked I this game. Because I, I have a defensive playstyle, and this doesn't reward a defensive playstyle. I'm, I'm not, I'm not that good at CrossCode. I'm competent at CrossCode, and this is one of the hardest parts of CrossCode. Ah, uh, good thing it's optional. Yeah. Ah, the second round. Good luck, Leah. So should I do the team cups, even though they're basically just the, the, the nah. normal cups, but you grab the team? <laughs> nah, not really. Not. I think I don't they might think be a little. Need to. Yeah. It it's kind of like showing the the Olympus Coliseum stuff with Sora, and then showing the Sora Donald and Goof. It's kind of like doing, doing the Sora this. Donald and Goofy ones, and then doing the Sora alone. There's not really a point in showing it, unless there's literally something completely different in there. I don't think there's enough difference in doing it. So nah. Calamity trigger. Huh. So what is that when Ganon and La Calamity Ganon and Lavos fuse together? What would a Zelda RPG be like? Uh, Zelda 2? <laughs> <Huh. laughs> Wait a minute. That didn't go so well, did it? Well, I mean, Breath of the Wild kind of feels like an RPG, even though it isn't. Also, Zelda 2 is not bad, it's just weird. I think it's just archaic, which is the issue. Remember this boss? I sure remember this boss. <laughs> Please don't tell me we fight that one bull that you got stuck on. <laughs> it might be. We're gonna the, fight that might, thing, aren't we? It might be the. It might be in the one. <laughs> the that blind really one. Blind. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> <laughs> well, at least we kill this thing supremely fast. I don't know why he's dying so fast. They probably didn't level up the boss. <laughs> I don't know. They, they yeah, they just don't seem like they were leveled they up. They definitely did. 
These don't seem like they are low. Wait, enough. what the heck? Why are they so low level? Again, they're, they just took the actual boss. I guess not. I don't think, that's, I I don't think that's supposed to be the case. I'm so confused. Oh well. <laughs> Time to die. <laughs> that's so weird. Was this a mistake in this port or something? I don't know. So, and you still don't think you get a gold for it. <laughs> Hot hombres. These ones are level 60! Yeah, they probably... They're, it's probably the case of just have the bo the regular boss. Probably because they think that the boss is hard enough. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that they, they, that's not how it works on the, in the PC version, though. I don't know. Dang it. I'm getting bad punishes for the video here, man. Now I'm missing and now I'm on fire. Yo, fire bad. Eh, <laughs> yeah, funny reference. Eh. Yeah. Uh, that's what I have to use cold, okay. Reference humor. Why I freaking love Whoa. that one Squidward <laughs> line from from Band Geek so much. <laughs> Band humor. <laughs> Good God! <laughs> and then he died. <laughs> Except he did it because high level enemy. <laughs> he might as well be dead. You broke his legs! And his nose. And his pride. Who's clapping? Uh... People. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> How are they watching? Do your news screens and then they... Yeah, that's level 36 too. What the heck? It's so weird. It's probably, again, just the, the boss. Because it's a boss. But why do they make the boss easier than the mob fights? It doesn't make any sense. Probably because it's a boss. Like, like I'm literally going to, I'm literally going to, like... Beat his first phase without. I literally beat his first phase without breaking him. Because I'm doing so much damage. Hmm. If it's so easy, Joel, then why aren't you getting a platinum? Because platinum was really hard to get. Yeah, it's what I thought. If it's so easy, then why aren't you getting it? Well, I'm just going over saying that so the comments won't have to. Actually, say anyway. Comments are good for the YouTube algorithm. Definitely didn't take that from a YouTuber. Why do you ask? So, so does this mean that the fight I got, the fight I was having a ton of trouble with, will be like level ten? <laughs> and it will still be. So we won't have to use assist mode after all. It'll still take you like five tries. <laughs> well, no, because it's gonna do literally no damage to me. Yeah, but you won't be able to do damage to it. <laughs> the I won't get stuck. I'll just take forever. And the problem wasn't that I couldn't hit him, the problem was that I, that I died before he did. Because I couldn't avoid his attacks. What boss are you talking about? It was a, uh... One of the, 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 head, the burying headphones guys, but it's a boss. Uh oh. Ah uh, yes, teleporting will, happen, will help me against the guy that you were supposed to melee attack. Of course. Why well, wouldn't it? Yeah, these still look like those annoying douchebags from Subspace Emissary. 
And yes, it is odd where where you have to ask which one. <laughs> like you you do you have the slightest idea how little that narrows it down? <laughs> Batman Beyond was great. <laughs> I still need to watch it. <laughs> huh? What? Frank. <laughs> what? When you, that moment when your highest health, that moment when your highest HP form is weak to the enemy attacks, and you're like, well, Frank. <laughs> Guess I'll just die. Guess I'll die. Yay! Get out of the way! Frick! <laughs> You're in the way! I don't remember these robot people. They're, they're in the... They're only in the dungeon. They're in the dungeon where you learn life. <laughs> As you go through the arena, you realize what kind of assholes that you forgot about, and you're like, OH GOD! Haha. So really? how long should we have the, these arena episodes be? Uh, I don't know. Because we're to about 37. We're okay. 37 well, minutes. What round now. are we on? Round five. Well, let's just end it here. We'll continue the arena next time on Cross Code with Bowser Galaxy 10. Well, Lee is going to be immediately able to get past the endless staircase. Look how many stars she's getting from this one encounter. I wish Mario's... Wait, why isn't she disappearing from the level each time? She grabs one. Must be Odyssey. Nah, <laughs> dun, 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 dun.